Hey tubers, I'm going to give y'all another vibrator video here. As you can see, we done went out there and got us a bunch of that, uh, boy that washer's shiny. Got us a bunch of uh, brass, you can tell we like to shoot. But uh, got to looking on the internet and uh, I can order just about all kinds of media, you know. So uh, I guess I'm gonna sit down, and give me some uh, some walnut order. And while I was while I was looking at it though, and, uh, there's a lot of people, you know, talking about kitty litter and pea gravel and stuff like that. That's what have come up with the brass. I'm gonna throw a bunch of brass in here and just see what happens. I'd like to have. We got a bunch of 40s in here. I'd like to have more of them. As you know they they really small but uh, we come back with a bag of a bunch of stuff we, you can tell we ain't picked up brass in a while didn't really get as much in there as I wanted to but our candidates today we'll throw this little shackle in there see what happens to the paint a little baby shackle and uh, got us four four bolts here we'll see what happens with the rust factor and uh, yeah I gotta keep these he's got to go back on something else I'll we'll see when we'll clean them up a little bit and another grease and rust factor and this here is out of uh, the Murray that I worked on last week. Brakes didn't have no brakes on it, and I tore it apart. And sure enough, a little push rod there was uh, seized up in the casing here. And we throw this in there for a cast aluminum. I always got all these cast aluminum parts. I like to see what happens to them because they they always they oxidize and they get real grungy. But, uh, you know, the whole point of doing this is uh, you, can, you can get you an old tractor, you know. Or, well, I mean anything. I mean, if you're working on a car or anything like that and you take it apart, well, uh, you got all these pieces, screws and nuts and things that uh, really really need to be cleaned up before you put them back on you know you know, put it back the way it was without ordering a bunch of nuts and bolts and a bunch of trips trash supply for stuff that don't match but uh, once I get this down I believe I believe we'll be in good shape but uh, I'm gonna do like I normally do I'm gonna let this run for about an hour and then we'll come back and check results I might, uh, might after a while grab me some pea gravel and uh, throw some pea gravel in there. I believe that pea gravel will do real good now that I've done some reading up on it. But uh, all right, tubers, I'll let y'all get back at it. And uh, we'll try this out. Thank you.